The Detroit Lions. Are we retiring this drop, Jason? Is yeah, this we your, don't you, need to carry on anymore with that. That's uh, it's that's over. Right? I don't know. Yes, I mean, I is, he a, is he a my guy for you? This year? He is probably <laughs> going to be a my guy. <laughs> carry on out of town. Oh, absolutely. I mean, I could see DeAndre carry Swift on still, running back to the Lions. I could see carry on. I mean, of course, you're going to know this is coming from me, but I still think he could have a, a, a career for a different team in the future. He's so young. I mean, it was like it reminds me of the, when the Cardinals back in the day used to draft great running backs and they sucked, and then they would leave and go sign somewhere else, you know, and, and they'd be great, whether it's Garrison Hurst or... or that hasn't or, exactly or, happened uh, with Detroit, Thomas. though. You've got Amir Abdullah in your... Mm. Yeah, mm. no, Do certainly, I certainly. Could, but, I mean, DeAndre Swift... Uh, a lot of people's number one, your Andy, my, number one running back, gets selected here with great draft capital. He's the third pick in the second round. Uh, early. I don't pick. think he's a winner though. He's not a winner no, for me. No, they're way. already they, like the, the the chatter is talking about how DeAndre Swift is a good complement to carry on. Yeah, Johnson. they're both going to the get the ball. The coaching staff is talking about. Let, I, so let, let me. Uh, sorry to sidetrack you, but. Uh, if you guys r recall, I traded Odell Beckham or for Odell Beckham in Dynasty right before the, the NFL yes, draft and the rookie yes. draft. So now there are names in our draft to associate to that trade. So let me oh, yeah. give you the names and see now how we, we feel about that. I traded the 105 and the 201 for Beckham. In our draft, that turned into DeAndre Swift. And then I probably would have been looking at uh, Mims or Pittman. Or my, and that's Denzel Mims, wide receiver for the Jets. Michael Pittman, wide receiver for the Colts. So I, let's, I would, let's say I would, Swift and Pittman for Odell Beckham. How do we feel about it now? I think it's a completely fair trade, and I would I would go with Odell Beckham. Uh, you know, I think the landing. Andy, spot. you were you were more on the pick side. So now that you're seeing the names and the locations, are you still the going with the the, the rookies? I'm not shooting for middle of the road with this answer, but the truth is it's just team need. I mean, if you were in that situation okay. where you didn't have a lot of depth, you you are building for the future, Swift and Mims, I'd rather have those two guys if I'm looking two or three years down the road, but Beckham is the better player right now for your fantasy team. And Jason, I I have if I had to put money down on Swift or Carry on having a better fantasy season, I wouldn't know where to put it, but I'd probably put it on Carry on. That doesn't equate to a good fantasy season. Don't get me wrong, but better, more fantasy points, I'd probably put it on Carry on Johnson. Well, that's weird and great to hear. I mean, I, I would put <laughs> uh, I would put it on Swift. I think that he's going to come in and and supplant Carry on, but I it's not going to be a one man show there. And this is a team that hasn't been able to find success since Barry Sanders at running the ball. Do uh, you think that he's more talented than Carry on? Yeah, yeah. I, I okay. think I think uh, Swift is more talented than than carry on coming in people are going to draft swift like he has the job already yeah like, that's swift not... will be up in the fourth round but at yeah. least yeah carry on's a, a gigantic gigantic uh, you know one of the biggest losers in the from the nfl draft this year because he they could have come away like some of the other teams like miles sanders where it's like you didn't draft a running back and you're giving him the job one more time he, he's not going to get another chance to be the workhorse hey everybody thanks for watching if those were the best few minutes of your life, you should probably click the subscribe button and check out a full-length episode.